gun-loving Ohio college student posing with a cup of liberal tears on the beach is slammed for sitting on the American flag. A gun-loving Ohio college student known for her support of President Trump has been criticized online posting a picture of herself sitting on a towel resembling the American flag. In what was meant to be an effort to troll her liberal detractors, Caitlin Bennett was instead slammed on social media for disrespecting old glory. Enjoying a nice cup of liberal tears at the beach to celebrate my president's birthday. Happy birthday at real Donald Trump. This one's for the haters and losers, Bennett posted to Twitter. The image accompanying the text shows her holding up a cup with the words liberal tears written on the front. The president turned 72 years old on June 14. Twitter users almost immediately pounced on Bennett, highlighting the codes governing the treatment of the American flag in the United States. Since you're probably one of the people who whine over NFL players disrespecting the flag here's the actual code you broke, Section 176, B. The flag should never touch anything beneath it, such as the ground, the floor, water, or merchandise. One social media user wrote. In response, Bennett replied, Did you just copy and paste the flag code and try to apply it to a damn towel? Oh my! The rest of the exchanges on Bennett's Twitter wall carries on in the same way, with supporters and critics slinging barbs at one another over the flag issue. According to U.S. federal laws, the flag code governs how the stars and stripes are meant to be handled and displayed in public settings. It does not. However, impose penalties for misuse of the United States flag and each state has its own flag law. The U.S. Supreme Court has struck down a number of laws meant to protect the flag from purposeful desecration, with the judicial branch determining that the legislation violates the First Amendment. Bennett, founder of right-wing group Liberty Hangout, first gained attention after posting a picture of herself carrying an AR-15 to her college graduation ceremony in May. Photos show Bennett, wearing a short, white dress with the rifle strapped over her back. In her hand, her graduation cap read, Come and take it. Now that I graduated from Kent State, I can finally arm myself on campus, Bennett wrote in the post. The pictures were taken just three months after 17 people were slaughtered at a Florida high school, marking the second deadliest campus shooting in American history.